I'm Simone Sullivan, and this is Blunt Reviews, a weed travel show where we review things to do while you're stoned. <laughs> I don't know what else to do in a small mountain town like this besides, you know, smoke a little weed. Go ice fishing, go hiking. I'm gonna go smoke weed and hang out in nature. It's really windy today. Frisco's really cute. It only has like one main street. People here seem really healthy and active and relaxed. I also noticed there's a lot of dogs. I'm pretty sure if you don't have a dog, you're like a weirdo and can't be trusted. <laughs> are things better when you're high? I don't know, I think most things are, but maybe there's some things that aren't, I don't know. I chose Frisco because I found a listing on a home share site that offered a curated weed retreat in addition to a place to crash, whatever that means. Come on inside. Thank but whatever, I'm down. Get you set up with a pillow, a little towel, some, a welcome bowl if you need it. This is great. Heck yeah. <laughs> you grow your own weed? Yeah, you know, you're allowed to in Colorado. Yeah. Grow six plants per person living in a household up to 12 total. So take full advantage of that. Got some smoking accessories here. Oh God, looking at this bong collection is taking me back to high school. Why does one dude need so many bongs? Wow, so you're like a stoner. Yeah, that's, that's one way to say it, I guess. <laughs> I'm an enthusiast. <laughs> Got a couple bongs to check out if you're interested. I usually don't really smoke out of bongs. Oh, this will be fun. Yeah. Yeah, where do you want to start? All of the bongs. Okay, that was fine. Yeah. Yeah, pretty smooth. Yeah. Bongs. <laughs> I'm sorry. I don't think I can be weed famous. <laughs> I need to do this privately. No. <laughs> <laughs> so should we go for a hike? <laughs> we need to go outside. <laughs> I'm not chill anymore. <laughs> ah. Uh, we can save those other two for later. Cool. <laughs> Let's do it. <laughs> yeah, it's slushy today. Uh -huh. What are you supposed to do when you see a bear? From what? I understand you're supposed to curl up in the fetal position and do a little play dead. Yeah, I really want to see a bear. So I'm kind of scared. It just reminds me of Narnia. Like the springtime in Narnia when everything's melting. It's still snowing beautiful, but kind of like. <laughs> I didn't really think about how exhausting it was going to be to hike super stoned at 10,000 feet, but everyone else seems to be doing just fine. That was beautiful. Yeah. Guy on some cross-country skis. I love it here. Coming up to a little steep part here. <laughs> and we made it. Rainbow Lake. Wow. It's mostly white. I feel like a painter would disagree. They'd be like, don't you see don't you all see the, the blues? Yeah. And the purple tones? Yeah. You're right. There are a lot of colors. It is a rainbow. <laughs> yeah, I really like this. Like at the end of the hike. So the next thing my host hooked me up with was an ice fishing adventure with a local guide who also likes to smoke weed. Hey. Hey, what's up? How you doing? I'm good, how are you? Good, good. You ready to do a little ice fishing today? Yeah, I sure am. Let's start walking out here. I've never been ice fishing before or regular fishing, but I'm super excited just to sit and chill in nature after that hike. So we got some spots right up here. I think we should uh, maybe start uh, punching some holes and see if we can get some fish on. What's that called? This is gonna be your ice auger. We're on two feet of ice. It's 15 degrees out, blue skies, fresh pow. <laughs> yeah, we'll see what happens. Right there, and then get that. There you go, now. And then slightly down. 
Yeah. Do you think smoking weed gives a fisherman an advantage? Well, it certainly gives you something to do, I think, when the fish, fishing slows down. I guess we should probably smoke something then. <laughs> you see that little line on it, that green line? Yeah. That's actually my lure. The light Gra green? Lightly grab that line and give it just a little, and then I'll watch the thing. Oh. Isn't that crazy? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> this is so much better than being stoned in New York. <laughs> It's like a real life postcard, you know? Everywhere. Everywhere. Here, fishy, fishy, fishy. We haven't caught any fish. <laughs> Yet. <laughs> Come back. Oh man. Come back. <laughs> Come on guys. There's a fish spotting. There's a little fish we on the screen. <laughs> Saw something, okay. <laughs> and he's gone, just like that. Dear fishy fishies. At this point, I'm pretty cold, mm. tired, and I'm losing my buzz. I'm kind of just ready to give up. So, can you see the appeal? Would you uh, try ice fishing again, even, even after coming out here and not catching? Yeah. We didn't catch a fish, unfortunately. Sometimes the fish just aren't hungry, so don't take it personally or anything if they don't bite. So I came back from ice fishing and stumbled upon the most Colorado thing ever. My host making weed-infused elk chili for him and his friends. Honestly, I think in order to live here, you have to smoke at least a pound of weed a week. I didn't catch a fish today, so I went the cheap route. City girl just can't catch a fish or whatever. I personally really love Swedish fish and I can't wait to share it with everyone, so. I guess I'm just gonna cut all their heads off. It's 200 milligrams of THC in the butter and 100 milligrams of CBD in the butter, 200 milligrams of THC in the salad, 200 milligrams of CBD in the chili, 600 milligrams of THC in there, and I'm gonna pie for dessert. Let's load it up. Oh yeah. Fuck yeah. Oh, and weed shots later. Oh. 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 Right. Is this the shots. chronic and tonic? Just out Edibles are the one thing <laughs> that can go crazy. There you go. There you go. Weed shots? Yes, please. <laughs> it's a bottle of Everclear <laughs> that I shook up with a bunch of decarboxylated bud that I had. Cheers. 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 <laughs> Thank you for having me in Frisco. Well, of course. <laughs> Thanks for coming. Oh, wow. oh, look at that weed, weed Oh, please, God, don't tell me there's more weed in that. <laughs> you just did it, you look like the rest of them. You guys do this often? Yes. <laughs> Family dinner is the best. Right about now is when the chili really started to hit me. Please don't draw a dick on my face. Thank you. Man, that fresh air just really takes it out of you. Woo! So the mountains have been really fun. Not quite as relaxing as I was hoping. I think next time I would do something a little more chill, but I'll try anything once. And I had a lot of fun meeting all these new people and trying this elk chili. But maybe next time I come back, I won't eat so much elk chili. And that's my blunt review. <laughs> You guys have fun hiking. <laughs> I'm staying here. I don't know if I'm going to be able to get up. <laughs>